Kevin, for you guys, these were probably for one day, two of your better offensive performances, just in terms of the amount of runs that you guys were able to score. What do you think led to that level of success against New Mexico? Um, I think just our pitch selection, really just attacking the pitches we want to and know that we can really crush. Um, and then I think just the energy has been really good. Like it's been feeding off of each other. So uh, I think just it's been an overall um, momentum moving forward. At least in game one, you guys used kind of the small ball a little bit to keep the lineup moving. Was that a strategy going in? In and and would you think so that I think hold on we had a connection issue there can you try repeating that question yeah um in terms of using the small ball in, in game one at least what was something that you saw within New Mexico that allowed you that you guys thought you would have a lot of success in that area um, I think going into it we just noticed that the first inning that they weren't really covering the bunts um that great. And moving forward, it was just something that we kept using uh, because it was working to our advantage. Um, so, yeah. Where do, you, where do you think you've taken a step forward, at least through these first couple of games from even last season? I'm sorry, can you say that one more time? Yeah, no worries. Uh, where do you think you've taken a step forward, at least early on in this season, as a, at the plate as opposed to maybe where you were last year? Um, I think I'm just utilizing uh, more skills this year, as well as I really focus on slowing down in the box to where um, I'm able to attack more pitches and be more in control of my body while I'm hitting uh, and compared to last year. And then how have you guys handled, especially some of the more veteran players who have kind of had a taste of success at the college level, maybe a little bit of a slow start in terms of producing at the top of that lineup. How have you guys worked through that or or handled Um, I think it just goes back to trusting the process. Um, The veterans, definitely we've, you know, been to regionals, we've experienced postseason. And so that's always the goal, but I think not getting discouraged and just remaining in the process and focusing on our game and what we can control has really been what we've been focusing on um, to get the momentum going. Uh, What's impressed you about some of these younger players who have stepped into not only roles in terms of just being on the team, but playing major roles on the field early on? Uh, The the newbies are really, really gritty, um, super gritty, uh, and they're fun to watch. Like whenever they're playing, you can just tell that they're out there just living their best life, taking advantage of the opportunities um, and just being grateful for what they're doing and like being able to play. And that really puts it in perspective for us. Like um, they're just fun to play with and they're really good. Uh, Coach, just overall thoughts on uh, how you think the team played today, just outside of obviously two and oh. Yeah, I thought we did a really good job of actually moving forward and putting our energy into winning the next pitch. Honestly, I think this is the best we've done all season at, doing that to work the process. Um, You know, in previous games, we've kind of like taken pitches off and kind of got sidetracked, but I really felt that, um, you know, as as a whole, as a team, they were in every single pitch and giving us the best opportunities. So I think they were able to take advantage of some things by being there. Some of that small ball strategy at the plate, was that a game plan going in or was it something that you you saw in game that you thought would be an adjustment that would help you guys? Well, we saw it in game. Um, anytime, I mean, it's just putting pressure on. That's all it comes down to. We've got a lot of speed there. Um, and when it's successful, you know, at first, then it can definitely create a snowball effect. Um, and it did that for sure. Um, but it's just finding another way to put pressure on the opponent. And then obviously, uh, besides having two of your better days in terms of just pure run production, you got some pretty good starts from your pitchers today as well. What did you like out of uh, both Missy and Aaron? Um, I thought it was a really good opportunity for them to, you know, really focus on what they could without having to worry about, you know, a bulk of a weekend. Um, They could be really present for just the games that they were in right there. And I thought they did a really nice job of that. I think it's easy sometimes to, 
see a whole weekend as, you know, five games in a weekend is a lot. And I know they're used to playing more than that when they're younger, but it's just, it's a different intensity at this level because you literally have to be mentally present every single pitch where when you're younger playing, speaking from experience, you don't. So um, I thought they did a really good job of that. It's a little frozen, Um, but I did. I thought they did a good job of competing pitch to pitch as well. Um, It was just a good chance for them and they took advantage of the chance to just get some momentum going for them and you know get some su- success rolling for them back again and particularly with that one hitter in game two what's been the difference in maybe Aaron in this game and AM versus when she struggled a little bit in that Arkansas game uh, she's been working a lot <clears throat> she's been working a lot uh recently on just her overall mentality she has a great mentality um but it was just a little off for her liking in the past couple of weeks, but she's getting herself back in the place where she wants to be so she can compete consistently. And I thought she did a really good job of that today. She felt good about it as well. We talked after. And then what was that difficulty? And we talked about not only playing some of your best softball of the season, but just being able to do it in a back-to-back consistently. What's the most impressive part of pulling that kind of feet off? Well, I mean, I think this is just the beginning of it. I think we're, you know, finally starting to see some fruits of our labor right now and understanding the process a little bit differently. I mean, that's a foreign concept to some of our players and that's fine, but, you know, we're kind of staying stubborn to it. And I think they're finally starting to see it and see the fruits of their labor a little bit right now. And so I think this is really just the beginning of, um, us going on an upward tra- trajectory here. Oh, that's all I got. Thanks, guys. All right. Thank you.